Sketchers, welcome back to my channel. For any of you who are new, hi, I'm Ivy. Welcome to my channel where I share beauty, fashion, lifestyle, married life, vlogging, all of the above. You can find it here on my Davenport. And today I'm gonna to bring you guys something super important that I think a lot of us just don't even think about. I'm gonna show you my plain skincare routine. I know y'all are like, girl, who's doing skincare on a plane? I'm trying to go to sleep. No. No, 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 no. You need to take care of your skin. Y'all know that I'm a huge advocate for skincare. Well, putting a lot of makeup over your skin is really not helpful. If you don't have a good canvas to put the makeup on, it's just not going to look as smooth. So of course your skin deals with genetics and all that, but we want to do the best we can with what we got. So we got to take care of it. So get ready because your skin is getting ready to go to new heights. Sit back, relax, and let's enjoy the routine. So with the holidays coming up, I am actually going to be on a plane at the end of this week. I have been on a number of different planes, sometimes for a long amount of time, short amount of time, it does not matter. Um, my skin sometimes will have little mini breakouts because it's just like, girl, this is too much. So sometimes my skin will just get little bumps and do a little bit of a flare up because it's just a lot of mileage to go on my skin to going on and off planes. You're dealing with different kinds of sanitations, different, you know, hygienes, you know, people being around you, different air, and you don't know what your skin is really taking in and what it's putting um, into your skin and really depositing. So you want to make sure you're taking care of it and just keeping it clear and fresh as much as you can. So before we touch our face or anything, we want to make sure that we have hand sanitizer on deck, you know, that you're touching different plane, you're touching different railings and you're touching your bag and all kinds of things. And you don't want to put your dirty hands on your face. So definitely use hand sanitizer. If you can wash your hands on the plane and get to the bathroom beforehand, that's even better. But if not, definitely have your hand sanitizer handy. So step number one. Do not, I repeat, do not wear makeup on the plane. Wearing makeup on the plane is not necessary. I go to the plane completely beat free. So this beat does not happen on the plane. I go with like big sunnies on or my regular glasses and I am chilling. I have no makeup on because your skin is going to just suffocate while you're up in that air. You're already at a higher um, level of air than what you would normally be when you're on the ground so it's not it's very thin air up there so your skin is already just taking in a lot of different toxins and things like that you want to just go makeup free because that makeup is putting a layer over your skin so it really can't breathe you want to make sure you have makeup wipes if you don't take your makeup off beforehand because you you know had it on you got a late flight taking a red eye or something make sure you have makeup wipes i love the neutrogena brand um, and they now come in single packets you don't have to take a whole pack you can take just a little single ones and just throw a few in your purse. You're good to go. Okay, so step number two, once your makeup is all cleaned off, and um, you can also bring micellar water. This is just another thing. If you don't have makeup wipes and you don't have your facial cleanser, um, bring micellar water and a little towel. That'll really get it all off and that'll clean your skin good as well. But a makeup wipe does the trick as well. Of course, you want to be able to use your cleanser and really clean your skin, but you know, this is why you don't, don't go with any makeup in the first place. But if you do, makeup wipes will work and it will get it pretty good. So step two on the plane, and to keep your skin hydrated, keep it well moisturized, we should do a face mask. Y'all, this is my favorite, oh, my favorite face mask. It is by Dr. Jart. It's the water replenishment face mask. It has so many good things in there for you. It has a lot of different, you know, hydrating properties in this mask. And yes, you may feel like, oh my God, I'm going to get stares. You know, I'm going to have this huge face mask on my face. But who cares? Haters going to hate, but you're going to have great skin. And they'll just be wishing that your skin could be there. So, hmm, girl, do what you got to do. And this is a really good mask. I leave this on for 20 minutes. It says 15 to 20. I leave it on the entire 20. And I love it because it can double as a serum. You, um, once you take the mask off, you don't have to rinse it, which is great because, of course, in the plane, we want to get up and down to the bathroom. So using this, just let it soak into the skin until it's completely dry. And you can even use it as a moisturizer if you didn't want to go any further. But we have more steps. I will spray this over my face. This is the Mario Badescu facial spray with aloe, chamomile, and lavender. I also like the one that is the green bottle of this as well. That's with aloe and something else in it. It's with aloe and green tea. I like that one as well. Um, they both come in travel size, which is great for the plane. I just spray, 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 spray all over my face. Let that soak in. The Face mask can be your serum if you want it to be, but I just like to add a little extra hydration. Then I will follow up with the True Serum by Ula Henriksen. It's got collagen boosted with True C Complex 
and it's got vitamin C in it to help brighten. So like I said, we took care of hydration. Now we're gonna take care of brightening and apply this to your neck and your face and it's just gonna help your skin become really even and glowy. It's beautiful. So almost the final step, we're going to follow up with our moisturizer. This is again by Ula Henriksen. It's their Sea Rush Brightening Gel Cream. Really, really good. I adore this. I, this is my second tube of it. I will probably need another one soon. I, it lasts for a while, but I love it. I use it every single morning. It's my daily moisturizer. And that just locks in that hydration and brightening that we just did. And it's going to make your skin glow forever. Like literally, I barely have any highlighter on because all of this is just that moisturizer. It makes my skin glow perfectly. It does not break me out. It doesn't clog my pores. It just it's magical. If you haven't got your hands on it, do so right now. So the last thing we do not want to forget is our lips and do not wear a matte lipstick on the plane. There is no need for that. Again, you're just putting a layer over your skin, pretty much a film over your skin and it's going to hold in all of your hydration and suck it dry instead of letting it breathe. It's just going to dry out your skin because it's putting a film over it instead of just letting it breathe. And so I like to follow up with the Laneige Lip Sleeping Mask and you can use this overnight, which is what I do every night. I put this on right before I go to bed and my lips are very moisturized and comfortable the next day. But this can you can just use a light layer of this or your regular uh, lip balm. I like the Burt's Bees Pomegranate Lip Balm, which is really, really good in hydrating and moisturizing. And it lasts for a long time. So either one of those really work. And then you just sit back, relax, and enjoy the rest of your flight. And that's really it, y'all. Thanks again for watching Eye Captures. I hope your seatbelts were buckled throughout that entire plane ride because I gave you guys some great tips that really are going to take off your skincare. Thanks again for watching. And please follow me at iDavenport on Instagram. You can chat with me there. I will come in the comments below, whatever you want to do. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button down below. Hit the notification bell so you're notified every time I upload because I have a few more plane videos coming, travel videos, so you know what to do with your skin, your fashion, all of the above. I got you covered. It's all here at iDavenport. Thanks again for watching. See you guys next time.